And speaking of football, for the first time ever, Baldwin High School has a flag football team. The Georgia High School Association created the new athletic opportunity for females last year. 41 NBC's Elizabeth Gutierrez spoke with some of the flag football players about their goals. The Baldwin County High School flag football team is lacing up their shoes and getting ready to throw the ball into their next win. Going into the first game, I was sort of nervous as I got on the field and the crowd started filling up. I got a little nervous, but once I got on that field, I just fell into my natural element. Angelise Hicks is a senior and one of 21 players on the flag football team. Hicks says she has always been interested in football, and with the help of coach Tara Burney, the girls say they're ready to tackle the next game. I feel confident in me, myself and my team because I feel like at practice we've been working hard and doing what we need to do to improve and fixing our mistakes that we made in the first game. For others like Camilla Darisaw, who is also a senior at Baldwin High School, going into the first game was nerve wracking. I was scared. We prayed a lot. Like before we came out here, we were in the locker room with everybody. We were just like, okay, let's pray, let's pray. So we said about like two prayers. Then we came out here, then we prayed again. And then when we actually got there, we was tight at first. But the second game, everybody loosened up and we just had fun like we do at practice. For many of the girls, this is their first time playing flag football, according to Coach Tara Burney. Coach Bernie says she wants to win, but more importantly, have fun. I want my girls to understand that sports develops leadership skills. From that first game, our girls learn a lot. The girls on the flag football team say they're ready to catch the ball and go into their next win. In Baldwin County, Elizabeth Gutierrez, 41 NBC News. All right there. Well, the team will play their next game on Tuesday, October 26th against Walnut Grove. They're expected to play their first home game on November 2nd.